Hello CNTVNA viewers, this is Maya from CNTVNA.com. Today is September 16th, 2015. I'm at the celebration of the 66th anniversary of the founding of the People's Republic of China held in downtown Vancouver. This is a long-term friendship that we have had between us. And a friendship with incalculable profit for all of us, not just financially, but in terms of people. Because our greatest resources is the people that live here. The incredible cultural exchange between people in our two countries, and how it was ordinary people from Guangdong province, who came to British Columbia all those years ago, many of them, and built this place. Ordinary people who created something absolutely extraordinary. Since becoming a minister, I have visited China on three separate train missions. And at the end of October, you all know I'm sure the Premier announced it, I will embark on another trip to China, along with Premier Prasika traveling to Beijing, Guangzhou, Shenzhen, and Hong Kong. And I hope that China continues to look towards British Columbia and Canada, because we are certainly looking to China. We are uh, proud to work in close partnership with uh, the whole community here that is growing and thriving in Vancouver and make sure we build stronger ties with uh, everyone in China. China has achieved a lot during the past 36 years and impressed the world with long miracles. It has become the world's second largest economy. The vast growth of the economy has pushed China to the center of the world. As the gateway to Asia Pacific, the province of BC has deep historical economic connections with Asia and China on behalf of the Chinese government and people. I formally welcome Honorable Premier Christy Clark and His Worship Gregor Robinson, Mayor of the City of Vancouver, to visit China in a few weeks' time to deepen the cooperation and enhance the friendship, and wish the visits successful. To the French, King China and Canada.